Welcome to St John's Laboratory video protocol series. In this video, we describe a basic protocol for immunohistochemistry. While your own protocol may vary according to your laboratory requirements, we aim to provide our viewers with the primary take-home concepts. When you receive your tissue section, it is likely to be coated with wax, so to remove this, submerge in histoclear for two 15-minute periods. While the tissue section de-waxes, prepare a 1% solution of hydrogen peroxide and methanol. Transfer your tissue section to absolute alcohol, minimizing exposure with the air to prevent dehydration of the cells. After a brief alcohol submergence, transfer the slide to the prepared hydrogen peroxide solution and incubate for 10 minutes. After this, soak your slide under running distilled water for another 10 minutes. Transfer your slide to a microwavable container containing 0.01 mole of citrate buffer. Microwave this for 15 minutes and monitor to ensure it doesn't boil dry. Encircling the tissue section with a PAP pen will allow the hydrophobic residue to localise the antibody solution through the process of application. Wash your tissue section in PBS three times for five minute periods. To block the tissue background, use a PBS solution containing 10% BSA and place on a rocker in a humidified chamber for one hour. Once the blocking process is complete, Briefly wash the slide in PBS before applying the primary antibody and leaving in a humidified chamber overnight. Then carry out a PBS wash as described previously. Tapping the slides gently between washes will help remove any excess liquid. Apply your secondary antibody at the appropriate dilution and incubate the slide for up to one hour. Following this step, repeat the wash phase again. The application of an ABC kit allows us to amplify the signal for individual binding sites. After this step, repeat the PBS wash process again. DAB forms a brown stain when it reacts with HRP in the presence of peroxidase. A 10 minute incubation should be sufficient to see this reaction and identify where the peroxidase conjugated antibodies are bound. Hematoxylin is a nuclear counterstain which binds to form dark blue or violet salts with acidic compounds such as DNA and RNA that hold negative charges. Apply this for 10 to 30 seconds before submerging in distilled water. Desolation clearing and mounting is a process by which the tissue section is prepared for visualisation. Desolation is a process by which water is removed from the tissue section through ascending concentrations of alcohol. Submerging for 30 seconds in each should be sufficient to dehydrate the slide.
Ultra Clear is then used to infiltrate the tissue so that it becomes translucent. Ensure that you allow incubation in three separate chambers for five minutes. When you reach the mounting stage, apply the solution to cover the slide and then holding it at a 45 degree angle, allow the solution to spread along the edge of the slip. Let go and allow the medium to spread, ensuring there are no air bubbles. Now that the slide is prepared, you should be able to visualise the protein expression of interest.